What's up guys, Shane Sarnes here with Droid Motor X. LG sent me the V10 and I've had the privilege of using that for about a week now. I've noticed that the fingerprint scanner is very accurate, very fast, but I'm wondering just how fast it is. In this video, we're gonna compare the LG V10 fingerprint scanner next to the iPhone 6S, Nexus 6P, and Note 5. By the end of this video, we'll know which one comes out on top. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so first up, we will match the Note 5 versus the V10. So we'll go in three, two. Okay, and in that test, it looked like the V10 was a clear winner. We'll try that one more time. In three, two. Yeah, the V10 is the clear winner. Um, it beats it by a long shot, actually. When I slow that down, you'll really be able to see it. Next up, we got the Nexus 6P versus the LG V10. We'll start this in three, two. That seemed pretty close. We'll try that again in three, two, Okay, the V10 seems to be coming up quicker. Like I said, it's very hard to tell and I probably won't even know what the difference is until we get it slowed down in editing. Three, two. Very close, very close. All right, next up we have the iPhone 6S. Now, just so you guys can see, yeah, I, I'm at a 4% charge, but just so you can see here, we're not on any kind of power, low power mode or anything like that. So the 4% charge should not affect the speed of the fingerprint scan in any way. Uh, so we'll match that up against the LG V10. All right, we'll do it in three, two. Okay, one more time in three, two. Try that again in three, two. Yeah, the iPhone beats out the V10. Three, two. The iPhone is beating the V10 in this test even with that slower animation. You guys can see that the V10 fingerprint scanner is super fast, it's very accurate. Yeah, any device that I'm able to activate the fingerprint scanner and then be able to use it out of my pocket, that is quick enough for me. Anyways guys, that about wraps it up for this video. If you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up, subscribe to this channel for more content like this in the future. You can find more of me at droidmotorx.com, follow me on Twitter at droidmotorx. Thanks guys for watching, be blessed, I'll see you in the next one.